Hello everyone, in this video we will see how to design and implement a 2-bit comparator using decoder. Here we are going to compare A and B. So A is having 2 bits A1, A0 and B is having 2 bits B1, B0. So in, at the input we will be having 4 variables A1, A0, B1 and B0. And there will be 3 outputs. One is when A is greater than B. Second output is when A equal to B and third output is A less than B. So let us consider the first case here a1 a0 is 0 0 and b1 b0 is 0 0 that is a is 0 and b is 0 that means a equal to b so we can put a 1 over here and this two, are, this two will be zeros. Next case is when a1 a0 is 0 0 and b1 b0 is 0 1 that means a is 0 and b is 1. So here a is less than b so we can put a 1 over here and the rest are zeros. Now the next case is when a, a1 a0 was 0 0 and b1 b0 was 1 0 that means a is 0 and b is 2 here also a is less than b so we can put a 1 over here and these are zeros. Next is when a is 0 and b is 3 that is 0 0 and 1 1 so again a is less than b so we will put a 1 here and zeros over here. Now the next case is when a is 0 1 that means a is 1 and b is 0 that is a is greater than b a is 1 and b is 0 so a is greater than b so here it is 1 and these are zeros. Next case is a is 1 and b is 1 0 1 0 1 so a equal to b the third the, this case is when a is 0 1 and b is 1 0 that means a is 1 and b is 2 so a is less than b. And this, the next case is when a is 0 1 and b is 1 1 that means a is 1 and b is 3 so again a is less than b. Now the next case is when a is 2 so for this four cases a is 2 and here for the first case b is 0 that means a is greater than b 2 and 0 so a is greater than b. Next case 2 and 1 a is greater than b. Next is 2 and 2 so a is equal to b. And the fourth case is 2 and 3 that means a is less than b. Now the next four, in the next four cases a is 3 and in the first case b is 0 that means a is greater than b. Next case 3 and 2 3 and 1 that means a is greater than b. Next is 3 and 2. So again A is greater than B. And in the last case A is 3 and B is 3. So A equal to B. So we have completed the truth table. So corresponding to A greater than B, we have written that uh, output in SOP form. So it is, uh, the output is 1 corresponding to min terms 4, 8, 9, 12, 13 and 14. So we have written that over here. Now for A is equal to B, the, when we write that in the SOP form, the output is 1 corresponding to 0. five then 10 and 15 and now a less than b is corresponding to 1 2 3 6 7 and 11 so we have written the three outputs in sop form a greater than b a equal to b and a less than b Now we can implement this using a 4 by 16 decoder. Since there are 4 variables at the input, we have to use a 4 by 16 decoder. 
So let us see the implementation part. Let us consider the case when the decoder output is active high. So active high decoder output. So our inputs are A1, A0, B1 and B0. And we will be having 16 outputs D0 to D15. So we have drawn the 4 by 16 decoder. Now we can draw the outputs that is A greater than B, A equal to B and A less than B. So for A greater than B we have to take the uh, min terms 4, 8, 9, 12, 13 and 14. 4, 8, 9, Then we have to take 12, 13 and 14. 12, 13 and 14. So we can give this to an OR gate. So this is A greater than B. So if any of these min terms come at the input, the corresponding output will be high and we will get high at the output of the OR gate. So if any of the input is high for an OR gate, the output will be high. So if we have 4 combination, that is 0, 1, 0, 2, 0, 0 combination, correspondingly D4 is high, active high output. Above uh, the high aisle, output is high aisle, or gate in the other, other than the or gate and output is high aisle. If we normally quote the tiller, either the one the one the correspondingly output is high aisle. So sum of product expression for output is one varana, so we'll get that. So we have uh, seen a greater than b, we have implemented a greater than b. Now next we'll see a equal to b. A equal to B in the other, sigma M 0, 5, 10, 15. So we have to take those outputs 0, 5, 10 and 15 and we can give that to an OR gate. So this is A equal to B. Apo e parana A thing lower output of Vero Anangala 0, 5, 10, 15 Vero Anangala. E parana D0, D5, D10, D15 varana outputs are higher. Correspondingly, uh, e or gate in the output in the a equal to b in the or gate in the output will also be high. Next is a less than b on angular 1, 2, 3, 6, 7, 11. So we have to give 1, 2, 3, 6, 7, and 11. So 1, 2, 3, 6, 7 and 11, we can give this to an OR gate. I will draw once again. 1, 2, 3, D6 
d7 and d11 so d6 d7 and d11 so d11 is here so we can give it as the input one or gate so this is a less than b so uh ipo input in the var another eight in the varano input on for example where the angular eight in the varana input on a varana angular at either one zero 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 on varana input on a varana angular as you know a one a zero is one zero and b one b zero is zero zero at either a is one a is 2 and b is 0. That is a is greater than b. a greater than b is the output is higher. But 1 0 0 0 is 8. Now d8 is active. d8 is connected to a greater than b. Now 1 0 0 0 is the output is higher. Now corresponding a greater than b is the output is higher. D15 is 15 and the is 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 0 0 0 1 input la 1 aanu varunengile adhaye 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1 aanu varunengile 0 0 yum a nu varana 0 0 yum b nu varana 0 1 a is 0 and b is 1 so a is less than b appo idha irikkanam active aavanadhu a is less than b active aavanam so nammal nokumba 1 d1 nu varanadhu it is connected to a less than b so output of that or gate will be high that means a less than b nu varanadhu will get it as high so this is the uh, two bit comparator implementation using decoder with uh, decoder output active high in active low i to decoder output which decoder output active low i to decoder you see that implement you can implement the same thing uh, using a instead of or gate you have to use a nand gate so we have seen that in the previous examples so that's all for this video thank you